Hi, I'm Dr. Randy Wright of Wright Orthodontics. Well, the American Association of Orthodontists recommends their first orthodontic evaluation at age seven. That's at about the same time all the first permanent teeth are coming in and we can get an idea at that time uh, just how much space there's going to be, if there's a crossbite, there's different things that can cause some problems. Um, I'm a big believer in phase one or early treatment uh, in orthodontics and we don't treat everybody that way but in certain cases, it can make a huge difference in the long-term result and the eventual result. Some of these types of cases might need you know, expansion of the upper jaw to correct a crossbite, get teeth out of crossbite so it doesn't damage the gum tissue surrounding certain teeth. Um, but, you know, if they have an underbite, we could do some, some good things early to correct that. I think it's a great, uh, great tool. It's just one of the things we do here that can make a big difference long term. Phase one treatment can lessen the need for extensive phase two treatment uh, later. It can expand the jaws where the, the other the permanent teeth can come in in the right spot and uh, solve a lot of problems early. You can also in a lot of cases uh, reduce the number of cases that require extractions of permanent teeth so when we try to do that uh, that's a big push that we have. In some cases, uh, if we're not treating them and recommend phase one, but we're observing them and waiting for the, some of those permanent teeth to come in, there's some things we can do to save some space when, when the ba large baby tooth comes out. We see patients uh, periodically to monitor them, and that's an important part of this too. The timing of treatment can be essential to getting the best result.